Together we are Bill Lisa. Welcome to our channel and welcome to season two. We are blasting off to infinity and beyond and we don't want you to miss a minute of the fun. So make sure you click that subscribe button down below and click the little bell as well. That'll give you a notification every time we upload a new video. Both of those buttons are free. They don't cost you anything to subscribe or get notifications. So do it right now. Elisa. Today in Disneyland, we are going to go around the park and we're going to talk to cast members that have really cool, unique costumes. Every costume in Disneyland is themed toward the land and the ride that the cast member is working at. So we're going to go around and check out some of our favorites and share them with you. Let's go. All right, everybody, this is Debbie, and she works right here on Main Street with one of the Main Street vehicles. Which one is it? The horse-drawn streetcar. Really? Yeah. And what do you like that's unique about your costume from some of the other costumes in the park? Well, our costume is essentially the same as the other vehicle drivers and the trains, but we have a red tie, which that's what distinguishes us from all the other vehicles. So you know if you see us with our blue and our hat and our conductor's hat with a red tie, you know that we're with the horses. Very good. Thank you very much You're for welcome. sharing. <laughs> we learned that your red tie separates you from the rest. It oh, it does. Everybody yeah. else has either a blue one or a black one. <laughs> well, your red tie makes you stand out. I like it a lot. Thank you. Thank you. All right, so we're right here with our good friend Steve. He drives the fire truck for one of the Main Street vehicles, and he wears this vibrant red shirt for his costume. What do you like about your shirt or your costume that sets you apart from other cast members? Well, this is one of the few costume pieces that hasn't changed over the years. It's the same as it was when it first started. Oh, well, that's wonderful. Thank you very much for sharing what? that. And how are you feeling? I feel great. I'm so glad to hear that. It was so wonderful to see you, Steve. Have a great day. Thank you, you too. Bye-bye. <laughs> All right, so we're here with Tessa, and she is security here. She's keeping us safe while we're here at Disneyland. So first of all, thank you very much for that. But we're going around the park, and we'd like to know what you love best about your cast member costume that's different from everybody else's. I get the most compliments on my tie. I bet. <laughs> I bet. I was just noticing once we actually have, are doing this and coming up and close and personal with you guys, seeing the detail in your costumes has been really, really interesting. And I love that with the little Mickey heads all over. Thank you very much. That's okay. You're no, you're good. <laughs> Thank you very much. Have a great day. Have a good day. <laughs> oh, I got to get this. She went shy on us. <laughs> Oh, hello there, friends. All right, we've made it to Fantasy Fair, and we're Fantasy here Fantasy Fair! Eric. Yes! And I just want you to know that your costume is one of my favorites. You want to know why? <laughs> why is it? Okay, because first of all, sometimes I know you wear a cape. And also, you've got a D on your shirt, and that kind of makes you like a superhero. It kind of makes me a superhero. A superhero of the princesses. Right? Yes, you can see all the princesses here. It's the fashion very beautifully here. All the sparkles from uh -huh. the pixie dust. Uh -huh, uh -huh. The lining of the gold was made from the seven dwarves. They found the gold straight from the mines. Wonderful. Donated specifically for us and okay. for the royalty here. And all of you here at Disneyland, which is amazing. Yep. In fact, I have a joke for that. Okay. I was with the seven dwarves the other day. We went to this local tavern. I said, oh my goodness, what are you guys doing in here? Uh -huh. They're like, well, we found out a statistic, and this guy doesn't think it's true. And they're like, what is it? Like, they said that six out of seven dwarves are not happy. Oh, oh my goodness, I can't believe it. I know, only one is. I know, it's hey. very true. Okay, I've got a joke for you. Yes. Who is the funniest princess? Oh, I don't know. Tell me. Rapunzel. Hey, Rapunzel. <laughs> you got it. Yeah, I would definitely comb over for that joke. I would never brush you off. You're amazing. <laughs> Thanks, Derek. Have a good day, friends. Thank, Thank you. you. you See you later. Bye-bye. Oh, yeah. So we're here at the Jungle Cruise with Caitlin. Hello, hello. And she has on some really fancy schnazzy khakis. I am one of the only people out here at the Jungle who has the matching khakis, which is exciting. That's very exciting. Oh, I see. Wow. 
this is the very fancy jungle coat. Yeah. It's very hot. Probably too hot for today. Is the rest of the costume comfortable? Yes. Oh yeah, they're definitely comfortable. That's good because I hear a lot of these boats get lost out there for days and, then and you have to sleep in it. So at least it's comfortable. Yeah, exactly. It's got a little vent in the back so you keep cold. Good to know. Oh yeah. Well, yes. So uh, all right. Anyways, as previously stated, that's your dream boat. I'm gonna be throwing you in. Thank you. You can, you can walk if you want. That's fine. <laughs> We're heading up to Terry at that right now. Of course, no worries. All right, we've made it to Pirates of the Caribbean. We're here with Michael yes. and his fantastic ensemble. Thank you. And first of all, I'd like to ask you, Michael, what do you like about your costume? My favorite part is the jacket, for sure. I love it. I think I wear it a little bit more special than everybody by popping the collar a little bit, uh -huh, uh -huh. hoisting it with my hat. I love that. I love it. So it's a little bit different than everybody it's else. It's a little fancy. It's a little fancy. I like yes. that a lot. But definitely this is my favorite piece, is the jacket right here. That's really good. Yes. Alright, so I've got a joke for you. Yes. Tell me if you've heard it. How much does Jack Sparrow pay to get his ears pierced? A buccaneer. Ba -dum -ba -dum. <laughs> <laughs> one for one. For one. Okay. one for one. Okay. I'm nervous. How was Jack Sparrow able to buy the black pearl sailing ship so cheaply? I don't know the answer to that. It was on sale. It was on sale. All right. Oh my God. And number right. three. This is the last one. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. Why does it take pirates so long to learn the alphabet? Because they get lost at sea. Oh, Yay! <laughs> Good job, Michael. Thank you so much. Thank you. That was wonderful. All right, one more time. Yeah. <laughs> And what are we doing? All right, we've made it to Big Thunder Mountain. We're here with Matt. He works right here at the wildest ride in the wilderness. Yeah. And Matt, what is it that you like about your costume? Uh, well, the only uh, cozier costume in the park is tiki's. Okay. Uh, you don't have to tuck in the shirt, shorts. It's very cozy. I'm, I'm a shorts guy. Uh, yeah. But the jacket is very cozy. I can wear shorts every day, which I, I take pleasure in. And the, the, the shirt underneath and the bib, the old minor uh, bib is great as well. It's just a cozy costume. I like it's, that. It's the coziest in the park. I've worked many uh, spots in the park and it's by far the coziest. Hat, shirt, shorts, it's all, it's very good. Wonderful, thank you, Matt. Uh, cheers, have a great day. Bye-bye. Hi. 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 Lego, we have the hat. We made it to Toontown. Um, it's movable, it's comfortable, it's fun, it's bright and colorful. Okay, how about you, Megan? It has a zipper! Yeah, that's true. Yeah! <laughs> colorful. Colorful, and I look like a Lego, and a train conductor, what more than you ask? I agree, sure. Sarah. Love the shape, the size, the color, and the availability, and I also like a Lego. Come and how about you, Angela? Everybody, Clementine's rocking the hat. Shay Ooh. said it's movable and comfortable, it's bright, it's colorful, makes everybody happy. I agree, it makes me happy. <laughs> Thank you! out from everyone else here. Um, I am actually a lead here. Um, I work for outdoor vending at the Disneyland Park in Anaheim, California. Um, it's just really comfortable. Wonderful. Yeah. Well, thank you so much. Yeah, no problem. Have, Have a magical day. day. You too. Here. All right, right here we, go. we have stepped into the Golden Horseshoe to end our video today. I hope you enjoyed learning about all of the cast member costumes because as you can see, they are unique to every land and every ride. And even right here at the Golden Horseshoe, they have unique costumes as well. Vanessa here looks fantastic. What is your favorite thing about your costume? Also my bow tie. I think every everyone has a different bow tie you can buy. Yeah. And I, I think this one's pretty cute. I like that. It's really cute. Look at the bows too. The details and flowers are really pretty. Too. Yeah. I like it too. All right. Brian, how about you? I like the hat. It's very I do too. Yes. And the pool with the scarf. Because I like the classic winter style. Until it's summer. I know, and then it gets hot. <laughs> it's nice and cool in here in the summer, though. Yeah, it's it is. It's cool in here. It's hot. It's too short. Very true. All right, everybody, I hope you enjoyed our video. And in the words of Walt Disney himself, if you can dream it, you can do it. So get out there and live your best life, but not 
before subscribing to our channel down below. Bye!